Fancy Fridays with me, Fancy Nancy, and today I want to talk about Easter because it's this weekend and I know things are different because of the coronavirus and most people are staying home, but I wanted to give a few ideas where you could still incorporate Easter with your families. So what I'm thinking is everybody could do like a potluck and make, you know, a certain item that you guys decide on and then you can go to people's houses and drop them off. And as you drop them off, you could also do some sort of Easter egg hunt where you are hiding a few eggs um, in the yard or I have a cute basket here that I've made. Um, and so, you know, you can fill them up with candy and so when someone comes to drop off a potluck, um, you can take some Easter candy and just a way to still interact with people but not keeping the whole social distancing in mind um, and still be able to celebrate Easter. And another idea that I have that is a no-bake tip that you could do to celebrate Easter. You know, Easter candy is one of my favorites because they have all the pastel colors. I love their lifesavers, their M&Ms, those kind of things. Um, and so another idea is you can make Rice Krispie treats and mix the colored, Easter colored M&Ms in them and then get like Easter cookie cutter cutouts and press them into the Rice Krispie and have those kind of Rice Krispie treats and it's non-baked, so everyone should be able to do that, even if you're not a baker, because I am not. Um, but that's a fun little idea that you can do and have it Easter incorporated. And still remember to decorate your house in Easter. I got this from the Dollar Tree, which I heard is still open, and they have a plethora of stuff that you can choose from. Albertsons also had a ton of uh, Easter stuff, and it's all 50% off since it's this weekend. And so I just wanted to remind everyone to still keep family in mind when you're at home during these times and make sure you're going outside and getting some sort of fresh air to stay positive. And one other thing that is not Easter related is if you have not filed for your homestead exemption and you bought your house last year or you were in your house this year on January 1st, the deadline to file for that is on April 30th. So make sure you get your exemptions in. If you have any questions about that, message me and I hope everyone has a happy Easter and is living just fancier.